would have made it past the arena's metal detector. Sorry, just trying to keep it positive. Which is hard to do because our story wouldn't be complete without talking about one giant negative. I'm referring, of course, to the arrival of the American hero, Brooklyn Von Braun in WWE. Because of Brooklyn, our lives and careers would never be the same. Although if you think about it, they were pretty much the same as they'd always been because no matter where we went or what we accomplished, we could never escape Brooklyn's loud, obnoxious shadow. We gave Brooklyn a lot of chances to prove she had changed. Well, mostly Trey did. But ultimately, she only proved one thing. She was the exact same bully she was way back when we were in high school. And she wasn't just a jerk to us. She disrespected anyone she dealt with, including WWE legends. What is up, guys? Expert winner here, but and call me Dominic. We are back here with WWE 2K20, my career mode. So, let's do this. Is that all you got? It feels like you're taking a teacup poodle for a walk on my back. Excuse me, Miss Von Braun. Can we talk? Can't you see I'm conducting important GM business? Come on, I really need you to get in there. Work it. It will only take a minute. What? I don't want my car washed or candy from your stupid kids fundraiser or whatever crap you're selling. Actually, I'm the original American hero, Kurt Angle. You know, the Hall of Famer you borrowed your nickname from without asking. Come back in five with stronger hands. So what do you want? An autograph from the real American hero? A picture? Tell me what I need to do to make you go away. I need you to drop the lawsuit against me. If you don't, it will bankrupt my family. No chance. I'm the way more famous American hero, and I will not allow you to continue profiting off my celebrity. I won a gold medal for my country with a broken freaking neck. What have you ever done that makes you an American hero? Uh, filed a trademark? Security! Wait. Maybe we can settle this without lawyers. If there's anything that could change your mind, I'd do it. Anything? It just so happens we have a superstar who was gone for a very long time and needs to knock off some ring rust. So I'll drop the lawsuit if you can beat Samoa Joe. But Joe's a monster. He's got that bionic arm that could tear me apart, and I haven't competed in years. Samoa Joe hasn't competed in years either, so it should be a competitive match. Good luck. Oh shit, Kurt Angle has to face um Samoa Joe. Alright. I wonder if I've got to play the match. I don't know. Let's find out, I guess. And it looks like we are have we do have to verse um Samoa Joe. Okay then. I have no idea what this has to do with Are you seriously wrestling in your suit? Okay then. Sure, whatever. Alright. Oh my god. Get him to yellow health, alright. Oh no. Oh, big clothesline by Kurt Angle. And slap to the face. And reversal by Samoa Joe. Reversal by Angle. Belly to belly suplex. Showing Joe how to use the maneuver. And... Dropping him down on his knee. Angle looks like he still has it in the ring. That one for the cover. One. Only a one count though. And strikes to the side of the face. And we got him to yellow. What do we have to do? Grapple move. Alright, let's do this. Angle slam. No, Joe. Oh no, with a bionic arm. Here comes Trey though. Brother, oh, roll up by Angle. 
One, two, three, and Angle picks up the victory. Samoa Joe is livid. I imagine Brooklyn Von Braun isn't going to be too pleased either. Too bad. All that matters is Kurt Angle has got the win, and now he can officially be known again as the American hero. What a victory by Angle. Let's move on. Since you like getting involved in my business so much, maybe you should pay all the legal bills for the lawsuit I have to drop now. Yeah? Well, you messed with us in the best of five series, and that cost Red her title. So I'd say we're even now. Is that what you think happened? I signed Samoa Joe because he was unfairly let go from WWE, not to mention he's a great addition to the roster. But I had nothing to do with him costing you the series. I don't control him. No one can. Which is something you should be very worried about. So if you're not out to get us, then prove it. Give me a rematch for my championship that I lost without ever being pinned. Let me think about that. No. That's what I thought. But what I will do is give the audience something new and fresh. Trey, you're going to face Adam Cole next week for his WWE Championship in a no disqualification match. See? Maybe I'm not so bad after all. Now if you'll excuse me, I need to go find someone else I can sue to recoup my losses. Adam Cole's the champion? Jeez, okay, cool. Let's do this. Alright, let's get on with this um, matchup. He's actually a uh, WWE champion? The system. Wow, okay. Let's see. Yep, there he is. Adam Cole. He looks good with the champion. Alright. Let's go down with this match. I feel like some shenanigans will, go, will happen with this match. Oh well, let's find out I guess. Alright. Let's do this. Get Adam Cole to red health. Big kick to the side of the face. Oh, strikes by Trey. Oh, spear into belly to belly suplex. Picks him up. Drops him on his face. Nice elbow drop. I was not meant to do that to ref. Whoops. Nice elbow drop, uh, not elbow drop, spinning forearm, taking him down, not even a one count by Adam Cole, oh Adam Cole's finally fighting back, and reversal by Trey, oh, playing possum is Cole, And reversal by Trey. Nice STO. Reversal by Cole. Reversal by Trey. Nice drop um, running legs. I don't know what that move was actually. Ooh. Fighting back at the moment, and a belly to back suplex. Beautiful maneuver. Alright. Is he looking for... Dang it. Dropping him down. Are you kidding me? Oh well. Yeah, one count. Reversal by Trey. And Adam Cole throws him outside. Throws him back inside the ring. Benning found forearm. Wake up, Taunt. What's Samoa do Joe doing? Um, you're an Aggie by Samoa Joe. What are you doing? Cover him. I'm not going 
gonna win like that. Fine. Oh, big strike. What is Samoa Joe doing? What the? Um, okay. I'd like to know why you would do that. What the hell? That confused me. Why would you want to um, help me win? Okay. I guess we'll find out. Cool. Damn it! I wanted to earn this. Now everyone's gonna look at me like I'm some kind of fluke champion. Again. I know you're frustrated, but maybe it's not that bad. Besides, if you defend it enough, then people will respect you. Seven years. Seven years ago, you took what was mine, and I never got to take it back. You know, a lot of significant life events can happen in that amount of time. Birthdays, holidays, Funerals, and I miss them all because for over 2,500 days, one thing has consumed me revenge. I even augmented my body to ensure that when the time came, there would be nothing that stopped me from destroying you. So now we're so close. I helped you win this championship for one reason only. So I can finally take back what you took from me. But that doesn't even make sense. It's not the same title. Don't! Don't say that. It's the same. It's exactly the same. Seven years, and the surgery, and the pain, and I am going to take it back. Hey! You want to tell me what that was all about? I had nothing to do with it. You think I wanted to win the title like that? I don't think you give a damn as long as you're champion. I want my rematch. I promise I'll make this right. Okay, chump. <laughs> okay, Trey, how about we do that right now? No, Trey, Trey, let's go. You waited seven years, seven, to get your revenge. Why couldn't you go to SmackDown? Ask SmackDown if they could um, hire you because you got um, fired by Raw. That's confusing. So, pre-recording, that title that Trey has in his hands is way different. WWE, please explain. Uh, I don't know if everyone has this thing or not. But this is a different title. So, let's just get on with the thing. From the outside, my life looked pretty good. I was WWE Champion, and I was about to team with none other than Ronda Rousey in the Mixed Match Challenge. The truth is, I couldn't enjoy any of that. I had a maniac breathing down my neck who'd spent seven years planning my demise. But at least my title defense against Adam Cole would take place in a steel cage so that psychopath couldn't interfere. Or so I thought. So we're versing Adam Cole and Samoa Joe is going to come in and help us win again? But I'm still confused. Why would you wait seven years? Alright, we got the steel cage match at the moment. Alright. Let's look at our entrance. Alright, the WWE Champion. Alright, let's go. I haven't had the chance to like, what's it called, change my attire, I don't think, I've been wanting to change it for a while. Alright, as Adam Cole's coming out, alright, let's go. Steel cage match, let's go. Uh, yellow health. Ow. Let's go. And oh, straight in the cage. Honestly, after everything we've seen from Samoa Joe since he returned, I'm 
Oh, reversal by Adam Cole. That beautiful neck breaker by Trey. Knees drop. Spinning. Oh, reversal by Adam Cole. And then reversal by Trey. All right, beautiful forearm. Nice, suplex. All right. Oh, playing possum, are we, eh? Beautiful reversal. Didn't make him do yellow health. Okay. Picks him up and power bomb. That dropped him to yellow health. Irish whip Adam Cole while he's in the ring. How can I Irish whip him outside the ring? I don't know. Joe is dead set on keeping the WWE Championship on Trey so he can take it from him after not getting his rematch seven years ago. Trey with a drop kick into the cage, sending Samoa Joe crashing to the floor. Trey isn't going to sit back and let Joe help him. Well, it's admirable, I guess, but I think he should take the help. It appears Red is out here to help get rid of Samoa Joe so Trey can show he can do this by himself. Don't feed into his ego, Red. If you were a real friend, you'd let him have any help he could get. Jesus, the security guards are struggling to pu pull him back. All right. Let's go. Beautiful clothesline. Win the match by pinfall or submission. Sure. So I can't escape the cage. Sure, okay. Adam Cole can, though. Oh... Knee to the back of the head of Trey. Ooh. Beautiful neck break. Um, yeah. And a knee straight to the face of Adam Cole. Oh, choking him in the corner. Adam Cole. Oh, Trey's got to get up if he wants to stop Adam Cole. Adam Cole's trying to escape. But Trey gets up just in time. And, oh, and drops him down. All right, pick up, get up, let's go. And backstabber, go for the cover. One, two, door, oh, two count. Oh, what's he looking for? Is he looking for? Oh, he reverses. I knew he was going to do that. And escaping the cage, as always. Nice. And a swinging his knee on the cage. I didn't do anything. Oh, it was playing possum. Okay. Sure. I was dancing in front of him. And he kicked me in the face. Oh, miss that, miss that insecurity. Step up insecurity. Strikes. Oh, misses a kick. But continues with the strikes. And Trey throws him on the um, cage. And best moonsault ever. Going for the cover. One, two, three. Oh, two count. Adam Cole kicks out. Nice kick to the... Oh, beautiful uppercut. 
And that didn't work out. Goes to the top of the ring. Is he gonna moonsault? Oh my god. Going for the cover. Two. Oh. He wants him up. Trey wants him up. He's feeling it. Can he hit him? Backstabber again. That's the second one. Going for the cover. Two. Three. Oh no. He kicks out again. Oh, what's he looking for? Oh, crossface. Damn, it's not what I want. I thought it was going to be. Oh, crossface. Can he tap? Is he going to tap? No, it lets him go. Going for the cover. Two. Three. And Trey picks up the victory. Beautiful. And Trey picks up the victory. Finally showing that he does not need Samoa Joe's help to win. Let's go. Extremely impressive win, guys. <laughs> I'll tell you, Adam Cole's never going to be an industry ruler with losses like this. Guys, I literally got chills. Holding that title up high. Championship match. Beautiful win by Trey. All right. Let's move on. Great job defending your title against Adam Cole. Thanks. More importantly, I showed everyone I didn't need Samoa Joe's help to do it. You have anything left in the tank for your mixed match challenge later? Honestly, I'm running on fumes, so I'm kind of hoping Ronda carries our team tonight. Mm -hmm. By the way, do you even have a partner yet? No. Brooklyn's making me wait until the last minute to find out who it is. Typical. Well, whoever it is, we might have to face each other at some point, which is going to be weird. I know, but FYI, I just put win mixed match challenge on the list, and I plan on being the one who crosses it off. We'll see. I'm surprised they don't actually be in a mixed tag match. Like, the team. Mixed tag team. Just me? Oh, okay. Well, anyways, I'm going to end this video here. Thank you guys for watching this video. Don't forget to hit that like button and subscribe if you want to see some more WWE 2K20 My Career Mode. Catch you in the next video. Peace.